morning friends, as we um, start this day, we are looking at 1 Corinthians 13 that says, um, verse 13, these three remain, faith, hope and love, and the greatest of these is love. And we are going to look today at hope. Hope um, is not something we do, not something that we trust, that what we think may happen will happen. Um, hope is a person, and His name is Jesus. And in, in Hebrews 10, verse 23, the writer of Re Hebrews reminds us of this. And he says, let us hold unswervingly to the hope we profess, for he who promised is faithful. Now we're looking to God, we're looking to our Savior, Jesus Christ. The promises he made is true, and he is faithful. And we look forward, not only in this life, in this day, but also in eternity, um, we have a hope that endures. And today, I want us to, to keep reminding us of our hope is not in, our, in ourselves. It's not in our accomplishments. It's not in our success or um, the gift God has given us. Our hope is in Jesus Christ. Our hope is in our God. And the writer of Psalm 42 ends this song um, where he is in deep distress, um, but yet he testifies of how God is his only hope. Listen to this prayer. As a deer pants for streams of water, O oh my soul pants for you, O oh God. My soul first for you, for the living God. When can I go and meet with God? My tears have been my food day and night, while men say to me all day long, Where is your God? These things I remember as I pour out my soul, how I used to go with the multitude leading the procession to the house of God with shouts of joy and thanksgiving among festive throng. Why are you downcast, O my soul? Why so disturbed within you? Put your hope in God, for I will yet praise Him, my Savior and my God. My soul is downcast within me, therefore I will remember you from the land of the Jordan, the heights of Hermon, from Mount Mezar, deep calls to deep in the roar of your waterfalls, all your waves and breakers have swept over me. By day the Lord directs his heart love, at night his song is with me, a prayer to God of my life. I say to God my rock, why have you forgotten me? Why must I go about mourning, oppressed by my enemy? My bones suffer mortal agony. As my foes taunt me, saying to me all day long, Where is your God? Why are you so downcast, O my soul? Why so disturbed within me? Put your hope in God, for I will yet praise Him, my Savior and my God. And we see how, how David writes, how his, his, uh, his enemy is pursuing him. And people are mocking him, asking him, where is your God? And he commands his soul, put your hope in God. Put your hope in God. And this day, I want to encourage you. I want to invite you to command your soul. Put your hope in God. For yet you will praise him, your Savior, your God, my Savior my God. Let us pray together. Lord God, our hope is in you and you alone. Lord, we, we have hope in the promises you have for us. We have hope, Lord, that you are the one that sustains us, Lord. We have hope in this day, Lord, 
that you will bring about your ways. You will have your glory in our lives in this day, Lord. Lord, but as for us, Lord, we, we command our souls. Our hope is in you and you alone, Lord God. You are the source of our hope. You are the fountain of our hope, Lord. Lord, would you come and reveal yourself as sufficient, Lord God, as sufficient to look for in this day, but also in eternity to come. I pray that in Jesus' name. Amen. Friends, we find faith is from God and in God. Our hope is in God and in Him alone. See you tomorrow.